The Challenge of Digital Marketing Many of us got into digital marketing thinking it was going to improve our lives in major ways. You may even feel that you were promised by internet marketing gurus that your life would suddenly be easy once you took up this line of work. Digital marketing means working online, and that in turn means working from anywhere and without a boss. So of course, life will be easy. You can choose your own hours. You can work out of coffee shops or from beautiful locations. And you can do it all your own way. Without someone breathing down your neck and shouting at you when you get things wrong. What's more, if you manage to achieve a passive income, then you'll be earning money even while you sleep. Passive income means generating cash from a website or a YouTube channel or through affiliate sales. It means that even as you are resting, the seeds you sowed continue to reap their rewards. So you can take time off whenever you want. And let's not forget that during all this, you will be discussing things that matter to you. Things that you are passionate about. Things that you can't wait to leap out of bed to start writing about. That's the dream of the digital marketer. Oh, and you're rich too. Dreamer, meet reality. The question you should be asking at this point though, is that if it is that easy, why isn't everyone doing it? The answer is that, of course, things are actually a fair bit more complicated. Because most people don't wake up one day with a website getting thousands of views a day and generating solid passive income. In fact, no one manages to do that. Instead, it takes a lot of time. Likewise, it takes a lot of time to build a massive mailing list that you can use in order to make money from affiliate marketing emails. It takes a lot of time because it simply takes that long for a site to take off in a big way or for anyone to collect that many emails. But likewise, it also takes that long simply to learn. You'll start off with your internet marketing venture not really knowing what you're doing. You'll make mistakes. You'll build a brand that you'll be embarrassed of in retrospect. And if you're anything like the vast majority of today's most successful internet entrepreneurs, then you'll probably end up scrapping your first few businesses and trying again. Trust me, I work in the industry and I know some of the biggest players very well. None of them got it right the first time. They all floundered at first with non-starter ideas and brands. That will be you. Trust me. And this is when running a business is not easy and is not fun. This is when digital marketing is hard. You were told you would be able to give up your job and start working from home right away. You were promised the world. Instead, you've done nothing but work your socks off, staying up late and giving up your free time, only for nothing to happen. And that can be crushing. What's more is that many internet entrepreneurs will never quite achieve passive income anyway. I consider myself an internet marketer. And yet, a large portion of what I do involves working for clients. And let me tell you, if you work for clients, then you might as well work for a boss. Even the nicest client in the world is going to expect you to honor your deadlines to at least some degree. Even the best gigs around will sometimes involve writing about topics you hate or designing sites that you don't massively approve of. How about all the times you don't get paid? Or the times where you're between clients and the money just isn't coming in? And when you work from home, how do you prevent yourself from going entirely mad? You know, even when everything is going well and you're getting paid for doing work that you enjoy, how do you avoid the temptation to sit in front of the TV all day? Likewise, how do you avoid the temptation to not stop working when it gets to 5 p.m.? How do you avoid the temptation to squeeze in just a bit more work? And a little bit more, especially if you're getting paid by the word or by the hour. How do you manage your finances, knowing that you're always going to have different amounts of money coming in at different times? Do you have what it takes to do your own taxes? This training is here to answer all those questions for you. Because there are two types of entrepreneurs. There is type A, who looks like a million bucks. They have quaffed hair or luscious locks. They are dressed in a sharp suit. They talk with authority. They go on lavish holidays. Everything they say is genius, and it's clearly apparent why they earn such a high salary. Type B, though, is the other kind. Type B is the kind who is always overworked, the kind who is effectively broke, the kind who is scatterbrained because they're basically too stressed and overworked to give their everyday lives the necessary time and attention. Type B is far more common. But the job of this training is to make sure that you are type A and not type B. Let's go. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.